Thank you. Thank you very, very much, ladies and gentlemen. You know, I wanted to start right off by telling you a very funny joke that I heard. But before I do, I would like to introduce a very dear friend of mine who is sitting in the audience. He's one of Motion Pictures, box office, greatest, he's the greatest attractions. And currently, he's appearing in a picture called Lover, Come Back. Mr. Rock Hudson, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. That was awfully nice of you to come in, Rock. Uh, this joke that I wanted to tell you we about... We want Rock! Ladies and gentlemen... We want Rock! We want Rock! Uh, ladies and gentlemen, this, this joke... We want Rock! Rock, take another bow. Take another bow. Just take a bow. Just take a bow. Thank you. Thank you very much. This joke... This... This joke... <laughs> You better come up here, then. Come on. You might as well come up here. Let's see, Rock, I, uh... Really, I want to apologize for bringing you up from the audience without any makeup on or anything. I mean, with these lights and the... and the cameras and everything, you must look awful. <laughs> well, that's all right, Jack. I don't mind. You know? Do you have any makeup on? <laughs> What'd you say? I said, are you wearing any makeup? Me? Am I? Rock, if the makeup that I've got on my face was on my shoulders, I'd look like the hunchback of Notre Dame. <laughs> Or rather, were on my shoulders. I mean, dramatical era. <laughs> but I, um, but you know, I can't get over everybody hollering, we want rock, we want rock. Well, Jack, yes. didn't people ever yell, we want Benny? Well, <laughs> just once. It was after one of my violin concerts. <laughs> I believe there were some rocks involved in that, too. <laughs> But anyway, I want to tell you, it's so nice of you to come up here, really, and come to... I'm flattered that you came in to see our show. Thank you. I really am. I, 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 I mean that. Will you please step back? I can't see him. The silliest thing I really that's about the silliest thing I've ever seen. I think Jack, I'm sorry if I caused all this commotion. I well, it, Rock, it's, it's not your fault. After all, you're a big movie star. Everybody's happy to see you. Look at the picture you've made. Magnificent obsession, giant, farewell to arms, pillow talk, come September. And then this this latest picture, Lover Come Back. Thank you for mentioning them. Yeah, well, gee. You know, I wouldn't be surprised, uh, Rock, that your pictures have made almost as much money as mine. <laughs> well, I don't pay any attention to those things, Jack, but yesterday my agent happened to mention that the combined gross of my pictures amounted to about $250 million. <laughs> How much did you say they... Two hundred and fifty million. I want rock. I want... I want rock. How many pictures have you made all together? Well, including my latest one with uh, Doris Day, Lover Come Back, I've made about forty-two. Forty-two pictures? Mm -hmm. How come I've never seen any of them? Well, maybe it's because they haven't been shown on television yet. <laughs> That could be. That could be. Jack, it's awfully nice of you to ask me to come up on stage, and I well, really must apologize for all the commotion. No, listen, you don't... Oh, wait a minute. Before you leave, I want to prove something, you know? Now, I'll admit you're good-looking. I'll give you that. <laughs> but, I mean, all of these women hollering, we want rock, we want... You know, I'm going to prove to you that sex appeal is merely a state of mind. 
A state of mind. That's right. Because a kiss is a kiss. I don't care whether it's yours or mine. It's all the same. I'm going to prove it to you. Now, wait. I'd like to get some young lady up from the audience up here, just uh, you. Young, you're the one that's been screaming so much. Come up here. Just yeah, a second. Just no, 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 no. Come up. Come up here. Just, just a second. That's right. Look, at, I want to prove something. Now, I want you to close your eyes. Here, I'll blindfold you first. Right here. Now, don't, don't look. Don't peek. And we're each going to kiss you, and I want to see if you can tell the difference, whether it's me or Rock Hudson. Now, don't, don't, don't peek. Now, don't peek, and I'll... And now remember, now we're gonna I'll go first. It is only a state of mind. <laughs> it must be a state of mind, because I'm a wreck. <laughs> anyway, there's a young fellow, this will be the first time on his show, on this show, and he's an amateur. But I think he's really going places, and I hope you'll enjoy him, and he'll get his start here. And uh, he's a harmonica player, a young fellow. Would you come in, sir? Would you come in, please? Just come in. Uh, come right over here. Come. Uh, don't, don't be nervous. He's, you know, you never have to be nervous on this show, does he, you? No, no, you never have to be, never have to be nervous. You never have to be nervous on this show. Now, um, uh, tell me, um, Tell me, um, <laughs> what, uh, don't be frightened. No, don't be frightened. What, I tell you, what is, what is your name? Hudson. Hudson, I see. I mean, what is your first name? Irving. <laughs> Irving, Irving Hudson, I see. Well, now, I told him you were a harmonica player, so why don't you go now and play something for him, will you? Go ahead, play something. Now, don't be nervous, just, just play, and don't be this is kind of a show, you don't have to be nervous. He doesn't have to be nervous. <laughs> Uh, how, um, how long have you been studying the harmonica? Four years. Four years. <laughs> and you're, uh, what did you say your name was? Irving. Irving Hudson. Irving Hudson. You know, that doesn't seem like an exciting name to me. You ought to get more, a name that would, oh, mean more. A name like, like Rock. An exciting name like Rock. Huh? Say, that does sound exciting. Yeah. Irving Rock. <laughs> Yes, yes, that, that would be good. Now tell me, uh, will you practice? How much, how much have you practiced, let's say, today? Really? Well, today I, I practiced just for an hour. Just for an hour? You practiced just for, just for an hour? <laughs> uh, yes, because... Well, uh, why? Is well, I, I, I just went down to see that new, wonderful motion picture called Lover Come Back, starring Doris Day. It was just great. Mm -hmm. That's why you're only getting $320 here. <laughs> Irving, I, I saw that picture, Lover, come back, and it really was great. I, I found it not only entirely enchanting, but as I left the theater, I had a feeling of exhilaration that I... Oh, shut up! <laughs> uh, 
Now, let's see. What else do we want to talk about? Something else? Something else? Uh, what'd you say your name on the uh, Hudson, Irving Hudson. Irving Hudson, that's right. I think well, thank you very, very much, Mr. Hudson, for coming thank over. You. And it was certainly nice. And I wish you a lot of success. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, you saw him here first. And now, we want Irving! We want Irving! We want Irving! We want Irving! Harmonica playing, evidently, you see. And um, now, what do you do besides? Uh, playing the harmonica. Well, uh, in my spare time, I'm a twist instructor at the Schleppermint Lounge. <laughs> the Schleppermint Lounge? <laughs> <laughs> Pardon me, I didn't mean to serve. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know, I think it's a terrible dance. I don't know how anybody can even learn oh, it's it. It's easy, it's easy. Huh? I, can, I can teach anybody how oh, to Oh, really? Do. You, come here. C could we have some music, please? But I don't want it on this show. We don't want twists. But listen, it doesn't fit on my show. A twist. Well, a twist doesn't fit on the show. 